reveal all about Kirill. Anna Kirill Padilla Tatlan Haryuzan, born March 22, 1981, known mononymously as Kirill, is a Filipino singer, actress, television presenter, songwriter, producer, entrepreneur, and philanthropist. Kirill dated actor Ding Dong Dantes from 2005 to 2008. Her relationship with Dantes was the subject of controversies and widespread media attention. Media outlets speculated that Dantes had been unfaithful to Kirill with his Marimar co-star Marion Rivera, with whom he began a relationship soon after the split. Their breakup was speculated to be what had driven Kirill to make her transfer to ABS-CBN. However, she subsequently denied such claims. In March 21, 2014, Kirill has been married to Sponge Cola vocalist Yala Yuzan at San Antonio de Padua Church in Puc, Silang, Cavita after dating for over three years. Their 10th wedding anniversary was celebrated on March 9, 2024 in a wedding vow renewal ceremony attended by Yael's older brother Yanni and sister Isabel alongside Buka's Pallid Music Ministry at Church of the Gisu, Quezon City. She is the granddaughter of boxing referee Carlos Padilla Jr. Her parents separated when she was six years old. Kirill has two half-sisters Nicole and Zia Quezon from her mother's relationship to actor and comedian Dolphy. Kirill completed her elementary and secondary education, notably in OB Montessori Center, Green Hills during grade school, where she was class valedictorian, and St. Pedro Poveda College, where she finished high school with a service medal for extracurricular and volunteer works. She began taking formal ballet lessons at the age of three and continued until she was 15. In college, Kirill took up BS management major in communications technology management at the 8 Neo de Manila University, where she made the dean's list. She graduated in 2002. Having achieved mainstream success across stage, screen, and music, her accolades include Fur Awit Awards, an Asian Television Award, two MTV Pilipinas Music Award, a New York Festival's International TV and Film Award, and a Star Award for Television, including nominations from Monte Carlo Festival, Olive Awards, and Golden Screen Awards. Born and raised in Manila, Philippines, Kirill first ventured into theater musical in 2000 and played several supporting roles in film and television. She rose to stardom after playing Sanger Elena in the drama fantasy series Encantadia, 2005. She reprised her role in the succeeding sequels and crossover such as Etheria, 2005, Milowin, the movie, 2005, and Encantadia, Pagibig Hanging Wackus, 2006. It was followed by the theatrical release of the blockbuster film Moments of Love, 2006, which she starred with Isaiah Calzado and Ding Dong Dantes. She returned to stage and appeared in two major productions, Cat in the Hat, 2007, and West Side Story, 2008, garnering praises from the critics. Following her transfer to ABS-CBN, she made several appearances in television shows such as Nays in Kamaruja, 2009, and De Hill May Sang Ikao, 2009, which earned a nomination at the International Emmy Awards. In 2010, she played a supporting role in the horror film De La and became one of the mainstay hosts of the long-running noontime show It's Showtime the following year. She was cast as one of the lead in the Singaporean TV series The Kitchen Musical, earning her a bronze medal for Best Performance at the New York Festivals and a Best Actress nomination at the Monte Carlo Festival. On screen, she appeared in several international productions such as Point of Entry, 2012, and P.I., 2017, as well as in the fantasy film Mystified, 2019, which earned a nomination at the Asian Academy Creative Awards. On theaters, she appeared in more stage productions in the following years including Rogers and Ramahari, 2012, Rogers and Hammerstein Cinderella, 2013, Carousel, 2022, and The Sound of Music, 2023, among others. As a recording artist, Kirill has released six studio albums since 2001. According to Perry, her most successful releases include the platinum seller's Time for Letting Go, 2009, Road Trip, 2011, and the gold-certified album's Time to Shine, 2001, and K, 2013. The song she co-wrote with Jerome Hughes, Pabijian Ng Puso, won Best Original Song at the 30th Metro Manila Film Festival for the movie Manopa 3, My Love. Her musical work have earned her nominations from Asian Television Awards, Awit Awards and Star Awards for music. 
Philanthropically, she has been active in supporting the Philippine Animal Welfare Society, PAWS, and charity organizations like White Cross Orphanage and Child House. Acting Career 2000-2004, Early Works In 2000, Kirill made her acting debut in the stage musical Little Mermaid, in which she played Princess Sapphire. Her performance in the Trumpets production is known to have been her breakthrough in show business. In 2001, Kirill began appearing on television. She became a co-host and performer in GMA Network's variety show SOP. From 2002 to 2004, Kirill took on a series of supporting roles in both films and television series. Her film debut was in Ang Ajimat, Antiing Antiing Ni Lolo, an official entry for the 28th Metro Manila Film Festival. In television, she made her first appearance in the drama series Twin Hearts, portraying the character Iris. Initially scheduled for only a week, the show's producers were impressed with the chemistry between Kirill and actor Ding Dong Dantes, leading them to ask her to take on another character, Jade, 20. The success of Twin Hearts paved the way for further on-screen collaborations between Kirill and Dantes in the subsequent years, starting with the fourth season of the romantic anthology series Love to Love. In this series, she portrayed Kathy Ruiz and Alondo from Gamaras, earning her a nomination for Outstanding Lead Actress at the second Golden Screen TV Awards. Kirill also had roles in two Manopa films, Manopa 2, My Home in 2003, and Manopa 3, My Love in 2004. 2005 to 2009, and Cantandia, and moved to ABS-CBN. In 2005, she appeared in the horror film Bahay and I Lola 2, her first leading role in a film. She then starred in the fantasy drama series Anacantadia as Sangeri Elena, alongside Isaiah Calzado, Ding Dong Dantes, Sunshine Dizon, Jenny Lynn Mercado, and Diana Zubairi. Anacantadia was a groundbreaking success, spawning a multimedia franchise. Kirill reprised her role in the sequel series Etheria and the crossover film Milowin, the movie, both released later in the year. In 2006, Kirill had two major projects, Encantadia, Pagibig Hengang Wakis, which was the third installment to the Encantadia franchise, and the romance film Moments of Love, which became a box office hit. In 2007, Kirill starred in two independent films, Liga Liam and Pi 7 on Tagpo. She also served as producer for the former, which was an official entry for the third Cinemalaya Independent Film Festival. During the year, Kirill also returned to the stage and starred as Cat in the Hat in the Atlantis production of Sisical. In 2008, Kirill appeared as host in the reality show Pinoy Idol Extra, alongside Rian Ramos. She then played the female lead role of Maria on the stage's production of the popular musical West Side Story, alternating with Joanna Ampill. This also marked her first of many onstage and onscreen collaborations with Christian Bautista, who stars as Tony. Her performance on West Side Story was acclaimed by critics, garnering her a nomination for Best Stage Actress at the 22nd Olive Awards. During the last quarter of the year, Kirill made big career changes. She changed her management from Genesis to Stages, her recording company from Universal Records to Poly East Records, and transferred from GMA to its rival station ABS-CBN. She signed her ABS-CBN contract shortly after an appearance in the Oscar de la Hoya vs. Manny Pacquiao boxing match in Las Vegas, Nevada, where she sang the Philippine national anthem. Her first appearance as a Capamilia was in the variety show ASAP. In 2009, after guest appearances in the musical drama anthology Your Song and the comedy drama I Love Betty Lafia, Kirill starred in Mars Ravello's Nazan Kamaruja? Alongside Christine Hermosa and Derek Ramsey, she would then be a part of the main cast of the international Emmy-nominated drama series, De Hill Maya Sang Ikao. Kirill also played the lead role in the independent drama film Litsonero, opposite Paolo Contes. 2010-present, International Breakthrough and It's Showtime. Kirill in 2010. In 2010, Kirill joined Bangs Garcia, Raver Cruz, and Sid Lucero in Gilda Alvedado's Magano on Ayang Dangal? Later that year, she started appearing as a judge on the noontime variety show Showtime that I end December. Kirill had a supporting role in the horror film De La, starring Chris Aquino. The film was a box office success and became one of the highest grossing entries at the 36th Metro Manila Film Festival. 
In 2011, Carrill officially became a regular host for Showtime, joining Kim Audienza, Teddy Corpas, and Curtis, Vice Ganda, Jugs Chigeta, Vaughn Navarro, and fellow newcomer Billy Crawford. The group of hosts was nominated for Best Talent Search Program host at the 25th PMPC Star Awards for Television during the year. Carrill also achieved international recognition for her starring role in the acclaimed Singaporean musical drama The Kitchen Musical, which aired across 12 countries via AXN. The series was highly successful, with the cast winning the bronze medal for Best Performance at the New York Festival's TV and Film Awards. Carrill's role as Maddie Avalon earned her a nomination for Outstanding Actress in a Drama Series at the Monte Carlo Television Festival's Golden Nymph Awards held in Monaco. 8. Furthermore, she and co-star Christian Bautista received an International Achievement Award at the 24th Awit Awards for their work in the series. In 2012, Carrill was featured as a guest star in the third season of the Singaporean action drama Point of Entry, her second international project later that year. Carrill also starred with her frequent collaborator Christian Bautista in a critically acclaimed staging of Rama, Hari at the Cultural Center of the Philippines. At the 26th PMPC Star Awards for Television, Carrill and her It's Showtime co hosts won the award for Best Reality and Game Show Host. In 2013, Kirill top billed a new version of Rogers and Hammerstein's Cinderella at the Newport Performing Arts Theater in Resorts World Manila. At the end of the year, Kirill received nominations for her hosting on its Showtime, Outstanding Female Host in a Musical or Variety Program at the 4th Golden Screen TV Awards, and Best Female TV Host at the 27th PMPC Star Awards for Television. From 2014 to 2016, Carrill's continued work as host on its Showtime earned her a second and third nomination for Outstanding Female Host in a Musical or Variety Program at the 5th and 6th Golden Screen TV Awards, respectively. She also received her second nomination for Best Female TV Host at the 30th PMPC Star Awards for Television. In 2017, Carrill starred in the Singaporean crime thriller P.I. In 2018, Kirill made a surprise cameo appearance in the finale of the highly rated and acclaimed drama Wildflower. The episode trended on social media, with many viewers finding Kirill's casting inspired. Kirill also appeared as guest presenter on the television news broadcasting show TV Patrol. In 2019, Kirill produced and starred in the fantasy film Mystified, distributed by iFlix. It was the first project released under Sanger Productions Incorporated, a production company founded by Kirill and her former Incantandia co-stars and off-screen friends Isaiah Calzado, Sunshine Dizon, Diana Zubairi, along with director Mark A. Reyes. The film was a success, earning four nominations at the 24th Asian Television Awards, winning one for Best Single Drama or Telemovie. The film was also nominated for Best Visual or Special Effects in TV Series or Feature Film at the 2nd Asian Academy Creative Awards after being announced as the national winner. In 2021, Kirill appeared in the romantic comedy television miniseries BNB, The Story of the Battle of Brody and Brandy, starring Isaiah Calzado and Ian Veneration. She also served as producer for the show. In 2022, Kirill top billed the repertory Philippines production of Rogers and Hammerstein's musical Carousel, opposite John McDangle, for her performance as Julie Jordan. Kirill received several acting nominations, female lead performance in a musical at the 13th Gawad Buhay Awards, best lead actress in a musical at the 36th Live Awards, and best performer in a musical at the 2023 Broadway World Philippines Awards. In 2023, Kirill primarily focused on theater and appeared in four stage productions. She played the role of Baroness Elsa von Schrader in the Manila run of the international tour of the Broadway International Group and Broadway Asia co-production of The Sound of Music. She then participated in the musical concert Contra Mundum, an all-star concerting on Larawan held at the Manila Metropolitan Theater, starred in the musical play Asang Gabi Ng Sarsuela, and reprised her role as Sita in a restaging of the rock opera ballet Rama, Hari. At the end of the year, Kirill also appeared in two comedy films, Ma'am Chief, Shakedown in Seoul, and Becky and Bidette. Music Career In 2001, Kirill entered the music scene with her first studio album, Time to Shine, released under Universal Records. IT spawned the single Can't Live Without You which won the Awit Award for Best Performance by a New Female Recording Artist and two MTV Pilipinas Music Awards for Favorite Female Video and Favorite New Artist in a Video. The album also includes two collaborations. Calling with German singer Gil Oferim and Kun Moawala Ka with Ogi Alkasid. The latter won the award for Best Performance by a Duet at the 16th Awit Awards. 
In 2003, Kirill collaborated with the contemporary worship musical group Buka's Pallid Music Ministry and released the religious song Awit S.A. Aina in Santo Rosario. It won them the award for Best Inspirational-slash-Religious Recording at the 17th Awit Awards. In 2004, Kirill released Pegbijian Ang Puso, a duet with Jerome John Hughes. It was the theme song for her film Manopa 3, My Love, which was an official entry at the 30th Metro Manila Film Festival. At the festival's awards night, it won Best Original Theme Song. In 2005, Kirill released her sophomore studio album, You Make Me Sing. The album includes the self-written songs Kaz, I Love You and Hailing, as well as Mahiwa Gang Puso, the official theme song for her hit fantasy series Encantadia. The album was well-received, with the title track being nominated for Best R&B Song at the 19th Wit Awards and Favorite Female Video at the 8th MTV Pilipinas Music Award. In 2009, Kirill released her third studio album, Time for Letting Go, under a new recording company Poly East Records. It is described as a collection of songs about moving on, exploring the five stages of grief. It was supported by the singles I'll Never Get Over You, Getting Over Me, and Almost Over You. The album also features Live For Your Love, a duet with her mom, Zsa Zsa Padilla, and three of Kirill's original compositions, Mina Mahal Kita, Hilaging Langit and Wala Nabang Laha. The album garnered her a nomination for Favorite Female Artist at the Fifth Mix Music Awards and was certified platinum by the Philippine Association of the Record Industry. In 2011, Kirill released her fourth studio album, Road Trip. She described it as her most personal and perhaps even most ambitious musical outing up to that point, representing who she is, as an artist, singer, and songwriter. All the songs were independently produced and written by Kirill. Its lead single, OMG, was featured in the American reality television series, Floribama Shore, and was nominated for Best Dance Recording at the 25th Awit Awards. In 2013, Kirill released Sayo Na Lang Ikeo, an official entry for the year's Philippine Popular Music Festival. It was included in her fifth studio album, K, which was released later that year and spawned the singles Kiss You and Kapiling Kita. The album was eventually certified gold by Perry.at the 27th Wit Awards. She received three nominations, Best Performance by a Female Recording Artist and Best Ballad Recording for Sayo Na Lang Ikeo, and Best Dance Recording for Kiss You. In 2015, Kirill was on the panel of judges for the 4th Philippine Popular Music Festival that I in November, Kirill released her sixth studio album, A Different Playground. She described it as a reflection on her married life to IT earned her a nomination for Female Pop Artist of the Year at the 8th PMPC Star Awards for Music. Additionally, the album includes the song Pano Keo Tituruan on Puso, which was nominated for Best Performance by a Female Recording Artist at the 29th Awit Awards. In 2019, Kirill released Simula, the official theme song for her fantasy film, Mystified. It was nominated for Best Theme Song at the 24th Asian Television Awards. In 2020, Kirill released The Holy Rosary, Roses for Mary, a spoken word recording of rosary-based prayers, which also included two religious songs. Other Ventures Writing Kirill is also a prolific writer and blogger. She has written blogs for Yahoo and was a contributing writer for the Philippine Star and S Magazine. Moreover, Kirill launched her own blog site in 2016. Producing Kirill has ventured into producing for film and television. In 2007, Kirill served as producer on the independent drama film Liga Liam, in which she also starred in. In 2018, Kirill, along with Isaiah Calzado, Sunshine Dizon, Diana Zabairi, and Marque Reyes started the production company Sanger Productions Inc. Through the company, she served as producer for the film Mystified and the miniseries BNB, The Story of the Battle of Brody and Brandy. Endorsements Kirill has also appeared in various endorsements for brands such as Ever by Lina, Bench Body, Sante Barley, Faridas, Adidas, Bello Medical Group, Uni Silver, Status Hair Salon, and Aura Care. According to the Ever by Lina executives, they picked the singer-actress as brand ambassador because she is a true reflection of a woman of her generation, someone who is passionate, sincere, and confident, and epitomizes the spirit of a strong modern woman. After her move to ABS-CBN, it came as a surprise to everyone when Kirill became an endorser for the clothing brand Bench, with her billboard seen all over the Metro Manila for the ad single is sexy, indicating that she was changing her image. Business 
Kirill is also an entrepreneur. She is the owner of the family KTV and Resto Bar Center Stage at Tomas Morado in Quezon City, Jupiter in Makati City, and Mall of Asia, MOA, in Paze, and part owner of Maylin Restaurant and of the Mango Farm Dessert Kiosk in Green Hills, San Juan City.